Welcome to the 208 Show, sports news, movie reviews, and careers. Hello everybody and welcome to our show today. Today we're going to be talking about the Cardinals. So Robbie, what do you think about that? Well, the Cardinals are very unsure where they're going to put Paris Johnson on the uh, offensive line, and they spent a whole first-round pick on him. It'd be completely wasted if they're not going to put him on their offensive line and can't find a place for him. I feel like they're kind of jumping into things. I feel like they should start with having him like a backup, and then have the starters train him and the veterans train him before they put him on the starting line. But I feel like he'll do pretty good. Like, like Robbie said, he's a first-round pick, so, you know. We have high expectations for him, so. Mm -hmm. So, Robbie, what do you think about the Jets cornerback, Sauce Gardner? Well, you know, he believes uh, Aaron Rodgers will elevate his game, and it probably will. Yeah, it just depends on they play together. It will elevate his game. He's better quarterback than the last one. He's good on the field. He's got that veteran experience, which could have put one to, you know, help in Sauce Gardner. Yeah, I feel like, you know, nobody even knows who the last Jet quarterback was. So... Obviously, he wasn't that good, and I feel like Aaron Rodgers would be good for the team overall and for good, good for all the cornerbacks, simply because he knows how defenses play and how they're supposed to react to things. So, I feel like he'll be a good asset to the team. Don't you? Yep. All right, everybody. Uh, that will wrap up our show today. We're going to pass it on to Luke and Braylon now. The Steelers traded up from 17 to the 14th overall pick, and they selected Broderick Jones. How do you feel about that? I think he'll be good because he's from Georgia, and our last pick from Georgia was George Pickens, and he did come very well. And he's an offensive tackle. We have a lot of young people on our O-line. What do you think? Um, he was definitely a position of need, and he only allowed one sack in college, which was pretty good. With the 32nd pick, they selected Joey Porter Jr. What do you think? We used to have Joey Porter, and he played for like 12 years with the Steelers. He'll be a very good fit. Yeah, we definitely need a cornerback. He was definitely a steal at this point in the draft. All right, that will wrap up this show. See you next time. Hello, today we're going to be telling you the upcoming schedule of West Branch High School for the next two weeks. May 10th, High School Senior Recogni Recognition Banquet. May 12th, Middle School Jazz Concert. May 16th, 7th and 8th Grade Choir Concert. Deuces. Deuces. Welcome back to the movie review. Today we will be reviewing Frozen. Frozen is about a story about a little girl who has powers. Her powers affect her sister and hurt her one day. So they have to go to the trolls to fix her. They go a long length just to fix the powers and fix her sister. Who are the characters? The characters are Elsa, Anna, and Olaf, Sven, Kristoff. Is there any character development? Yes, Elsa becomes way more dependent for herself, and then at the end, I can't tell you, but there's a lot of change in this story. I give this movie a thumbs up. Deuces. Today on the Career Talk, we're going to talk about middle school teachers. Middle school teachers typically go from sixth grade through eighth grade. Many teachers focus on one subject. Their pay is $61,320 a year. You need a bachelor's degree for this job. The job outlook is 4%. There are 606,500 jobs currently. You need communication skills, patience, resourcefulness, and physical stamina. Thank you for watching. See you next time. Bye. Bye.